sure that America's favorite seafood after shrimp is salmon. And today I'm gonna to share a great recipe with you for an herb crusted salmon and spinach salad. While the salmon bakes in the oven, you can make your salad and dinner will be done in about 20 minutes. I just tore three pieces of white bread into my food processor. To that, add a cup of flat leaf parsley, washed and dried. Pulse that to combine. And add a tablespoon of olive oil and some salt and pepper. This is a nice bright green crust. You can add other herbs if you have them on hand. A tiny bit of fresh thyme or a little bit of oregano might be nice. If you have a lemon on hand, you can zest the lemon and throw that into the crust too if you want. It's nice and bright green and it stays pretty green as you bake it too, you'll be surprised. I have four pieces of salmon here. These are skinless salmon fillets. They're about six ounces each. What you want to do is coat them with a little bit of Dijon mustard. The Dijon mustard not only adds fantastic tang and flavor to the salmon, but it also acts as the glue for your crust. Have your oven preheating to 450 degrees. It's always good to start preheating your oven right before you start cooking because it usually takes about 20 minutes for the oven to come up to temperature. Then you want to press your breadcrumb mixture onto your salmon fillets. These are kind of skinny, which means I may not end up using all of my breadcrumb mixture. This is equally delicious on other firm fleshed white fish like bass it would be good on, halibut even. Anything that's thick enough that you can cook it in the oven. So anything about an inch thick or an inch and a half thick you can throw in the oven with this coating. Delightful. My hands are a little bit covered with crumb coating. I'm going to rinse them off and then get this into the oven. They'll cook for about 11 minutes. While you're waiting for your fish to cook, you can get a salad ready. This is five ounces of baby spinach. To that, I'm going to add half of a red onion, very thinly sliced, a couple tablespoons of lemon juice, it's a simple salad. I'm not even making a separate dressing. I'm just dressing my salad right in the bowl. Olive oil and salt and pepper, simple as that. Lemon juice is one of my favorite dressings. It's so bright and light and just full of flavor. I really love it. Give it a toss. Make sure that you do this right before you're ready to serve because you don't want your salad to get wilted. Mm. Good, go get my salmon. Do you see how it's retained some of its greenness? I mean, it's not as green as it was before, but it still has a really nice, bright freshness that I love. Give yourself a piece of fish. This is a very long spatula that's designed to pick up pieces of fish, and if you eat a lot of fish, I recommend buying one. A little bit of salad. If you're so inclined, you can cut up a little piece of lemon to serve on the side, squeeze over your fish. And there you have it, a bright and fresh dinner in 30 minutes or less.